Hey YouTube, how are you? Um, this is Dollar Tree Haul Part 2 from my video I just made. It's actually take 7 or 8, I don't even know right now. I'm still new at this. My son um, has told me that he thinks it's this great idea that we do it unedited because he's too busy to help me right now. And so I'm trying to do it and for some reason um, I asked a couple people their suggestions. They said always do landscape view but I just did a whole 15 minute video and you guys would have been watching me going this way. So I'm now gonna try to redo it and I really hope that it comes out right this time. Um, so I pretty much should have it down on how to describe everything because again, I just, I've done this several times now and it's still not working. Anyways, it's Amy with Bargain Mama and please like and subscribe my channel below. Um, please also leave comments uh, what I can do better, what I'm doing good, be nice. Uh, just because I really want um, this channel to thrive. So with that being said, uh, let's jump into this, okay? So this one, we'll start with this. We'll start somewhere. So my, uh, sorry, I have um, three boys, a 20 year old, an 18 year old, and a 15 year old. My 18 year old um, had been accepted into LA Film School and was supposed to be leaving there very soon. Um, before all of this started. Now we're not sure exactly what's gonna happen. He has worked very, very hard, made lots of little short films, um, put them into different contests. Um, so he's kind of down and bummed. He will probably be able to do them online this semester and hopefully um, leave for LA the following semester. But nothing is set in stone right now with everything that's going on. So I wanted to kind of surprise them a little and redo his room in like a movie theme. So I bought these little popcorn containers from the Dollar Tree and it's two in here for a dollar and they're a thick plastic so they're not like some cheap little thing. Um, and so I'm going to use these for the decor and we'll see how it goes. Um, I think it's going to be pretty cute. I think that if I use them for like little um, pencil holders on his desk while he's doing his work, um, that would be a really cute idea and he would at least know that we thought of him and that we really are proud of him. Even though we tell him that all the time, I just want to make him feel special. So the next thing I got is this and it is the bigger popcorn container. Um, and either one is a good deal. This is again like a, a thick kind of plastic. Um, so I feel like this is going, I'm going to use for decor, I believe. I've never done this and I don't know how it's going to turn out. So I plan on using this popcorn container, I think. And I bought this square, I guess piece, I don't know, of foam. It's dark floral foam, 2.9 inches by 3.9 inches by 3.9 inches. I'm probably going to need more than one, but I'm going to put it in here, I think, and then let me, I'm going to put this down and show you my next thing I got and then I'll kind of try to show you how I plan on putting it together. So the next thing I got was, I'll sh I got two of these, so I'll show you the front on this one, seven photo crops and the back right here and that red, I love how it's like, um, is it called iridescence? I think so, but it's just very bright and I love that it's not just a flat color. So it really brings it like 3D-ish into light. Um, so again, this is what it is. And it has two popcorns. It has two champagnes. I believe that's what it is. Movie tickets, glasses, and the director's thing. And it comes with these little sticks. So my plan, I think, is to take them out and to stick them into here and to just make some sort of little kind of, I guess, bouquet thing to put on this headboard or something. I don't know. I have no idea where I'm going with this so that he has this, um, so he, he can just use it. I don't know. This whole haul is about trying to redo his room on just the Dollar Tree stuff. Um, and afterwards, maybe I'll show you what it turns out. If you don't see a video of what it turns out, it means it didn't turn out. So the next thing I got was this photo backdrop, um, pho photo prop back background. Oh my gosh. So it looks like the red carpet and it has like the little lines. It's just very cute. Um, it's plastic and it is 44 inches by 72 inches. So I have two ideas. 
Either one, I hang it behind the, um, I'm sorry, my neck itches. Either one, I hang it behind the um, TV that's mounted on his wall just so that it gives it more decoration. Or I was thinking maybe I'll get a second one and how the curtains are over there. Maybe I'll kind of tie these back over the blinds in his room. I don't know how that's gonna turn out, but it was just an idea. Um, all of this is just an idea. The next thing, I got was just this photo director thing. I don't think it's a photo thing. It's a director, but it's a photo frame. So and it is 12 inches by 17 inches. So he loves um, Star Wars, loves them. Seen every single episode, every May 4th, he had to miss school. I mean, he is in love, obsessed with Star Wars. So I thought they have those um, Star Wars bags at Dollar Tree. And so I think I'm going to get one and like cut it and see if I can get it to go back here. So it looks like the director's frame is around the Star Wars. We'll see how it goes, guys. Um, again, I only have a couple more things. And this one is all related towards me trying to redo his room, um, like a film room. So the next thing is another two things I'm going to put together. This is just the old 8x10 plastic um, frame from Dollar Tree. And I wanted just this one without the actual frame around it because my idea is that um, before all this happened, my son worked his butt off on um, trying to make this little short film about his older brother, whose life is a hot mess right now, but we all love you. Um, so he is um he worked his butt off trying to make this film and it was supposed to come out into this little theater where we're from uh, in the beginning of april i believe and people were going to buy tickets and go watch it and it was a big deal for him well when the corona hit he was no longer able to do that and he had made out flyers and all these things so i took one of the flyers and my plan is to put it in here and then to possibly use these yellow tickets that are like movie tickets, raffle tickets, whatever you want that I got from the Dollar Tree. There's 250 in here. I'm not using 250, but I'm going to put them, I think like around the edges right here so that the picture's in the middle and then the little like movie ticket things are on the outer edge. I hope that turns out. I just really feel bad that his film didn't go. Um, my next thing is just the paper popcorn bags from Dollar Tree. There's eight in here and they are five inches by three quarter inches by 10 inches. So my plan for these, you know, the little stars, um, the glass star dishes um, that you get, I think they're like potpourri dishes from Dollar Tree and stuff, um, like the Hollywood Walk of Fame um, kind of thing. Is that what it's called? I think so. Um, to try to Mod Podge some of these on there and um, maybe put candles and stuff around. I don't know. I don't even know if he wants candles, but it'll make his room smell better because anyone out there with boys knows anything that you can get in your boy's room that smells good is amazing because you open a child's door that is a boy and play sports and you don't ever want to breathe again in your life. I don't think it's just my boys, but let me know. But oh, whew. when when I open my boy's room after they have played a sport or something, that first thing that comes to you, I'm like, did you shower afterwards? Like, yeah, sweaty socks. Oh gosh, yeah. Mm -mm. Anyways, the last thing, I'm sorry. Yeah, this, this is the last thing. Just a little red tin. Um, nothing in there. Just a little pale. My, I went from movie to red and white themed um, because I found this and I couldn't find a whole lot. So I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Maybe poke some holes in it that look like a star and put another candle in here because yet again, anything that smells good that you can put in a boy's room is amazing. So that is my haul for this time. Um, and we are at nine minutes. So I do just want, um, to say a couple of things. I, again, I want to say thank you so much, uh, for, watching my show or my channel, not my show. Um, there's so many people out there that you could be watching right now. Uh, so I do want to say thank you so much for choosing mine. And I hope probably not in this video showed you something that you um, wanted to get, but hopefully in one of my videos, I will show you something that you're like, Ooh, I need that in my life. And so I do want to say that I do want to do, um, a 250 subscriber giveaway. Um, if I ever get to that, uh, so 
when we get to that, I will definitely send out a little package and we will do some kind of drawing. I don't know. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, um, and I'll show you little by little the things I get for that. And then uh, I do want to do just little giveaways. I want to hit like 500, 1,000, things like that. And the next thing is, like I said before, I do have three boys, four dogs, a husband, and it's me against this whole house. So some things, um, when you're a mom of three boys, a lot of you know, um, it it's, you know, you learn, you learn fast. So sometimes it's funny. Um, I have no one to do face masks with. So sometimes I can get my 15 year old to put a face mask on with me. Um, so maybe those kind of things I would really like to put on here and so that maybe I'll give you guys a laugh also. Uh, usually it's my, only my 15 year old I can talk into doing those things with me because he doesn't have a choice. The other two usually avoid me like the plague. But anyways, I thought that it would be fun to kind of show you guys a little bit about my life and um, I guess that's it. So I just want to say thank you to everyone. Please like and subscribe to my channel below and I hope you all have a great Memorial Day. Thank you so much.